clumsy. <laughs> you tripped me. Did not. Did two. Did not. Did two. Not two. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Want to do Shorty? something about it? Shorty, what's going on? Who did? Him. Him? You mean the one you tripped? Yeah, he... I mean, no. I didn't trip him. Shorty, come on, it's me. Now give me the truth. Ah, uh, okay. I tripped him. So what do you say now? Sorry. It's okay. Shorty's a good kid at heart. He just likes to get things started. You okay? No permanent damage? <laughs> no. I'm fine. Good. Name's Braun. What's yours? Littlefoot. No kidding. That's funny. They called me Littlefoot when I was young. Really? That is kinda... Littlefoot! Here I am, Grandpa. Oh, Grandma and I wondered where you had gotten to. <laughs> we, uh... Braun? Papa Longneck. Uh, Littlefoot, uh, this is your father. <gasps> Littlefoot, I... Littlefoot! Wait, come back. Hey, wet you <laughs> Littlefoot. Littlefoot, we have to talk. Where were you all this time? Where were you? Oh, Littlefoot. Your mother and I knew we were going to have a hatchling. You see, we wanted to raise you in a safe place. So before you were even an egg, I went off to find a new home. For all of us. When I got back, the Earth Shakes had changed everything. It took me so long to find where the nest had been, and nothing was left but a crack in the Earth, as deep as a mountain is high. As I searched for your mother, and the young one I knew had been born. The great circle rose and fell many times, but I couldn't find you anywhere. I finally met someone who told me about... about your mom and her sharp tooth. But he had no word about you, so I kept searching. And then one day, I met a group of young longnecks, wandering in the wilderness with no grown-ups to protect them. At first, I hoped one of them was you. But I soon realized that wasn't the case. But they came to depend on me. So I stayed with them, took care of them. And then some others joined up with us. And then some more. And some more. And in time, we were a herd. You mean, you're the leader of a whole herd? Yeah, I guess you could say that. Wow. And look at you. You've grown up to be a fine young long neck, just like I'd hoped you'd be. Your mom would be proud. She'd be proud of you too. <laughs> <laughs>